presentation of Arturo, Arturo Sandoval, an internationally acclaimed trumpet artist, on Tuesday, March 24th at 7.30 p.m., must see Mrs. Cuba in C206 before Friday. The cost is $5. German Club t-shirts will be going on sale for club members now at the price of $5 each. In the senior corner, if you're planning to go to grad night before you can purchase your ticket, you must get your field trip form signed by your parents. You can pick up one in the front of the concession stand during lunch. Grand night tickets will go on sale today, sorry, today during lunch in the concession stands by the auditorium. Tickets are $70. The class of 92 t-shirts are also on sale for $8. All monies owed for lost or damaged books must be paid before you can purchase a grad night ticket. Seniors, if you plan to apply for financial aid for college, the time is now. Financial aid forms will be available in the CAP office in A111. Workshops are being held to assist students who need help filling out the forms. Please sign up at the guidance counter in the student services office. In sports news, the activities bus will be picking up students at 5.30 p.m. There is one going south and one going north. Students will not be allowed in the bus without a pass from the activities office, room A139, or the athletics office, room A140. Congratulations to our Braddock's Rockets on the first place and third place finish last Saturday night at the South Florida Color Guard Circuit Competition held at Miramar High School. The Braddock Badminton team continues undefeated winning both of their matches last Friday against South Miami and Jackson High School. Winning both their matches were Nelson Quintero and Kirk Reif at boys singles, Orlando Fernandez and Carlos Contreras at boys doubles, Yannette Orta with Hilda Varela at girls doubles, and Camilla Becker with Alan Gill at mixed doubles. Winning one of their matches were Paula Abarca and Karina Iglesias at girls singles, Marco Ortega with Patrick Flora at men's doubles, and Margaret Fernandez with Melissa Torres at girls' doubles, and Hilda Artola with Tommy Warnock at mixed doubles. Braddock will try to extend the record to 5-0-1 tomorrow in a home match against Southridge. That's it from all of us here at WBHS. Have a nice day. Peace.